showers are going to continue to track to the east, seeing some heavier pockets a little bit. Uh, you're well rested. Not you're really. Well rested. <laughs> Not really. I ain't took no cat nap. I, I took a cat nap last night. I've been up since three. I, I couldn't sleep. Oh, you might be with me, David. I don't know. I might catch 25. Who knows? You might get a 25 out of the day. Yeah, I know. Everybody's coming today. Yeah, I know. I'm excited. I'm excited for you. I want you to win. I hope so. Let me get this on, guys, first. Yep, go ahead. Yeah. Mark Rose. Let's pray. I know this day looks kind of gloomy, but this is the day that you've made, and we're just going to rejoice and be glad in it. Good luck, Good luck man. Appreciate, Appreciate it. you. Thank you. Me. All right, guys. Day one. It's day one. <laughs> day 97. All right, final day, championship day here at Lake Norman. Seconds. I'm excited. Um, it's kind of bad weather today, but hopefully it gets the fish biting. I'm going to go large my fishing all day. Try to drop it back. First pier was phenomenal. It's really on fire out here. Man, I'm kidding. It's cold. Bass are just snapping. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Lines out. I just thought about this. We could have slept two and a half extra hours this morning. Huh? I had the same thing yesterday, I think. Zero. I'm going to fix that pocket, Rick. Right there. And then I'm going to go to the back of this creek. And then we're going to go out of here and go somewhere else. Five, four, three, 
two, one, lines in. Anybody caught anything else? Jacob Wheeler caught a, a one eight. But it, it changes a uh, daily weight. He's still ten pounds one ounce for the day. Oh, no. Or it's gonna cost you two minutes. No, I got it. Come here. <laughs> <laughs> no! Come back. Sucker. I need two minutes. But they're biting too good. <laughs> Come on. Take me two minutes to get the boat back over there. There we go. <laughs> Boy, they're good to do that field. That's what we do. Man, at least we'd have had something exciting happen today. Thrift's got a three pound zero ounce and a two pound six ounce. Oh, that's sealed up. He's, that's, the, uh, uh, that's sealed up. That's it. Hey, it's done. He's at 12 pounds, four ounces for the day now. Yeah, it's done. Here's Dustin Connell. Looks like he's in the red light district where we saw uh, Wiggins do a lot of his damage throughout the event. Come here, baby. There's your three pounder. I'm out there catching, trying to catch Lord's mouth. Just go over here and catch spots and be done with it. Three pound, three, three pounds. 15 ounces. What? Two pounds, 15 oh, ounces. Two pounds, he said three fifteen. man. He grew. How about that, baby? Big spot. <sighs> so we'll... Tell me about that. So we'll stay up there here. <laughs> <laughs> All right, then. Well, that's a good way to get on the board. Connell's here. first is nearly three pounds. Let's see if I can catch me a limit of spots real quick. I've been stubborn all morning, trying to lower my fish, shouldn't have. Sometimes I like that though. So, I'm gonna stay up through here for a little bit. Fishing. Catch the limit and then go ahead fishing. One pound, right. 12 ounces. All right, sounds good. We'll catch the limit right here. And then we're going to go head fishing. Catch two bigs. That's so stupid. <laughs> oh, God, <laughs> Look at this cluster. Here and catch us a limit. 
Dustin Connell oh, pulled good. off a magic act each of the last two days to get here to this championship round. Knockout round number one caught a 2-9 with 12 minutes left. And then yesterday, knockout round two caught a 3-14 with five minutes left to get in. So that's three, and he actually moves from 10th place to 9th place. He has two more available in his five fish limit. Connell started the day in 7th place. And his three day total is 3115. Oh. Oh. this concrete embankment and Dustin Connell trying to work his way toward his five fish limit for the day. Yeah, we've seen Wiggins on, catch a on. load of fish on, off his thing here. throughout the week. He might do it. He might do it. All of them in the pound and a half to two pound category. Though. No real big ones. I, I remember did. Jesse had eight one. Five, I think it was three pounds of all the fish we saw. But to your point, I was just scoring. One pound, eight ounces. Uh -uh. I done did it. That's right, baby. Catch us a limit and go catch two five pound lord mouths. Get interested. So that's four for Connell. Moves him up to eighth place. He has eight pounds even. I can't run down three. We at least don't make us a little more money. Huh? What you think? Business decisions being made on the board. Need eight ounces to give us seven. That right there is like my little dog, Billy. <laughs> Ain't no pain. <laughs> I cracked you up on that. <laughs> Dang, that's a, that's a <laughs> Connell has gone from ninth to sixth in this period. You have to call a one eight now to change your story. Thank you. 
13 right there. One pound, 14 ounces. One 14. I love spots. I love them. That's so fun. Yeah, man. Thank you, buddy. What is the full ounce? Never know. You may put in there and get two, four pounds. You got to call a 112 next. I will do that. They are stacked. They are stacked. Pounds, one ounce. That was cool, son. <laughs> That's what I wanted to do. Was come here and cool. That was a seven ounce cool. You're 15 ounces behind Adrian, and you got a color 112. I think I can do this. Seven minutes, 40 seconds. Three times in a row I did that. Three pounds, one ounce. <laughs> last minute, thank you, got me last minute, three pounds, three, three, one. About the same size as him. <laughs> I like it. That ends my tournament on uh, Lake Norman. Thank you, buddy. Yes, sir. Seventh place. Did I jump up? Yep. <laughs> In the last minute. That's what I'm talking about. Excited about it. I'm 
land, I land at least jump up a spot. So, uh, yeah, it was a great tournament. Congrats, Brian Thrift, on your home lake. You the man. All right, guys, that wraps it up for me on Red Crest. I caught me one last cast on a glide bait using MDJ's rod, his hex rod, 20 pound Seaguar, uh, Red Crest. You were good to me. Glad to make a top 10, finished in seventh place. And uh, I'm excited for our next tournament. We go to Cherokee next. But uh, as for now, that's it for me on Lake Norman. And then you got that first bite, and then you're like, oh, wow, they are here. I was being stubborn. I went large fishing this morning. I don't even want to really talk about the fishing that much. I just want to say, what's up to this crowd out here? Come on with it. They can keep that kind of noise going for every single angle, even when you're not up here. Yeah, Charlotte's showing out today. I appreciate it. It feels good to be out there in 40-degree weather. My hands are hurting. And, uh, and to come back to this, this is awesome. But yeah, I was stubborn a little bit this morning, but I knew I had a big deficit and I went out there and um, I, I went and caught a few spotted bass and then I went back largemouth fishing. I've never had a largemouth bite all day, but uh, I felt good about it. And uh, it's been a great week for me. You know, let's take a look at some of the highlights here. And uh, this wall that you're on, Wiggins, he found it too and he did pretty well off it. I saw Wiggins sitting over there. I was gonna run over there and go kick, try to catch a limit and Wiggins was sitting there every time I ran by, and I was like, oh, man. So I ran over there, and I was like, well, let's go catch a limit. And then I went back largemouth fishing. But we had fun there. I caught, like, 25 fish. It was fun. The Red Crest title, it's a game changer. And and this one here, you knew you had to go with – I think the weather was about just the same when you won that title. Yeah, um, you know, th this tournament is super special to me because I've won one of these, and I know how big it is, you know, for your career. And – it's hard for me to sit there and try to fish for like a top 10. I want to win. Everybody wants to win, you know. And uh, so I went out there and I fished hard. And even in those brutal conditions, man, and, and, and uh, to, uh, you know, my hat's off to Brian. He absolutely dominated. So um, I, I just heard that uh, we're going to Lay Lake next year for Redcrest. I live 12 minutes from there. Remember, it does go off limit at some point. That's it. So, hey, I want to say another thing. You know, I want to thank all my sponsors, um, Bass Pro, Favorite, Guggen, you know, all these companies that support us. I caught all my fish this week. Uh, actually, on the first day, I crushed them on a jerk bait. I was using a 6.8 Favorite uh, Pro Series. But um, another thing I want to say, the fishing industry and, and everything uh, – is so healthy right now. I, I look around and I see like a ton of high school kids. And raise your hand if you're in high school. That's what I want to know. There is a ton of guys out here in high school. So it, it really makes me feel good knowing that that, that younger generation is coming up because I, I swear, like in my mind, I still feel like I'm in high school. Even though my... I'm, I'm, my back hurts every day, you know. So, uh, but yeah, and, and to, I want to say this too. I literally, like, I live this dream every day. Like, I get out here and I launch my boat against Edwin. I see Brian. Like, dude, I watch these guys in high school fishing. You know what I mean? Yeah. And, like, it's a blessing to get out here and do this for a living. So, if you're out there and you're 15, 16 years old, I promise you it can happen. So, keep that dream alive, and I appreciate everybody coming out. Well, I have seen your YouTube channel and your Instagram. You are sort of still in high school in some sense of the word. Let's hear it for Dustin Connell! On the task. 
And he's going to go over it with another tattoo. That's right. <laughs> hey, thank you, man. Appreciate it. Thank you so much. Oh, yeah. Awesome, man. Yeah, sure. My man's got the tag, boy. Oh, Dean. God, man, is it just me or do I hate putting up rods? Y'all hate putting up rods? I hate it. I absolutely. I just want to throw them in the. I want to throw them in the back of the truck so bad. All right, guys, that wraps up Redcrest for us. We finished up in seventh place, and um, I, I ain't gonna lie to you, Lake Norman, you got me. It was tough on me. The rest of the tournament on day one, I had a good day. Every day was a good day, but uh, it was tough on me. I grinded, tried to tried to make some last minute heroics, and we did. And uh, we finished up seventh place, first top 10 of the season. Hey, quick little fun fact. If you turn the camera this way, if you pan the camera this way, these guys are hammering it out. I used to uh, work in construction up the way up here, Winston-Salem, and uh, that's the kind of stuff we worked on. And now we're going in here to eat lunch. But anyway, I don't know. I'm just, I look around and I see all these construction sites and all that and I'm like, God dang. I'm glad I ain't got a hard hat on no more. And let me tell you on the flip side, if I did, it'd still be a good day. It didn't even really matter. I, I, I count every day as a good day. And for all my guys out here hammering out with a hard hat on, you the man. Cause I've been there too. So uh, anyway, I appreciate you guys tuning in. It was a great week at Lake Norman. We go to Cherokee next. Oh yeah, matter of fact, I start practicing two days in less than 48 hours. I gotta practice again. The high that morning is 24. They're not gonna be spawning. They're not gonna be spawning. It, it looks like it. the flowers are blooming, but guess what, it's 24 degrees and next week it's freezing every day. They will not be on bed. I'm excited. Um, small mouth on Cherokee, Douglas large mouth and small mouth. This next few tournaments are gonna be fun. Appreciate you guys. Uh, appreciate you guys tuning in. That was Red Crest, the Red Crest series. Thank y'all for tuning in. As always, like, subscribe. We really love it. Really appreciate you uh, watching our channel. Thank you again. See ya.